the vice chairman of China's Central Military Commission begins a five-day visit to the United States this week. The first stop for General Fan Chenglong is Boeing's facility in Seattle. The trip comes at a time when the two countries are in open dispute over a number of issues. Our reporter Han Bin in Beijing tells us more about the general's visit. When General Fan Changlong visits the United States, he's ready to face some tough talks. The visit comes at a crucial moment when new tensions are rising over issues like the South China Sea. The United States will fly, sail, and operate wherever international law allows, as U.S. forces do all over the world. Beijing voiced strong dissatisfaction about a close encounter by a U.S. biplane above its islands and reefs in the South China Sea. Yet it is taking a restrained approach. We hope relevant countries will work together in the same direction to view the South China Sea as a sea of peace, friendship and cooperation. Washington has criticized Beijing over its constructions in the South China Sea. China says it's within its legitimate rights, and the U.S. is taking sides by only blaming China for doing the same as other countries with claims in those waters. The construction on some islands and reefs in the South China Sea is mainly for the purpose of improving their operations and the living conditions of personnel stationed there. It also serves China's need to better perform its responsibilities regarding maritime search and rescue. Cybersecurity is yet another hot topic. U.S. officials have fingered Chinese hackers as the source of a recent attack on its federal records. China says it is in fact the biggest victim of hacking, and the U.S. actually owns the world's most advanced technology. We say, Hacking attacks on the Internet are anonymous, international and hard to trace, making allegations starting with maybe without solid investigation and research is a trumped-up charge. It's groundless and irresponsible. Military-to-military -military exchanges between the two sides have seen some progress in the past year as the two sides committed to a new model of military relations. Beijing sees Fan Changlong's visit as a chance to seek new cooperation. But it's also a new test for their commitment and trust. Han Bin, CCTV, Beijing.